the regional demarcation proposal recommended that Orange Moon, Karasberg West, Karasberg East and Namingnus constituencies be incorporated in the Kara South region, while the remaining constituencies including Kirtmanswap Urban, Kirtmanswap Rural and Beersheba be incorporated in Kara's North region. In the community of uh, Orange Moon constituency, uh, of course after doing the deliberation of uh, the distances which we are covering, which I'm saying is about 1,000 kilometers because it's 500 to come and 500 to go back when we came to attend the regional activity. Uh, as well as the absenteeism of the service, uh, some of the public services, the community are proposing the regional demarcation into Karasa and Karasma. Joanna Ileka Nangolo, Chief Administrative Officer in the Orange Moon Constituency Office, said the community is in consensus for the region split, although some concerns were raised. The proposals were welcomed, but then there were still concerns raised. Now, then if we now um, split the region into two, would we not be blowing up the national budget? Um, and then also um, the seat of the new region. Um, the members just wanted to know how that is probably determined. How is it determined? Residents of Kara's region who participated in the consultation opposed to the idea of splitting the region into two. Um, my point of view regarding this is yesterday it was mentioned that Karas is the least the least second populated region in Namibia. Please correct me if I'm wrong if I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. This was mentioned yesterday. So if Karas is the least populated region, mm. is it really, uh, does it really make sense to make it a north and a south? I'm saying I think uh, it's a complete, I mean, uh, starvation campaign. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I'm not at this. From an economic point of view, I mean, uh, it will stay for us. Citizens, it's not an issue. It's the travelling of the council to, let's say, get one or or Bindu, and that is basically irrelevant when it comes to the distance because the office is the one that is playing the role there. We have just 46 <coughs> schools, 10 private schools and uh, 21 hostels. Should the region be divided, then it means that um, Karas South will have only, and I calculated it, 60 schools and 5 hostels, um, which is not cost effective. Luke Mantluta, NBC News, Kirtman's work.